See, as far back as I can remember, I was writing poetry or quotes or writing down my feelings because back then I didn't really know it was technically poetry. I would just basically write down anything that I was feeling or I was seeing or I was, you know, watching someone I loved or cared about go through. Shit, I even wrote things that I watched somebody in study hall go through with the girl he liked or the boy she liked or in the hallways at school. I remember I wrote my first poem, you know, other than roses are red and violets are blue and yada yada and X, Y, Z. I wrote it in probably fifth grade, I think it was, and it was submitted into some poetry contest that I don't even remember who did or what for or what school, but I ended up winning a blue ribbon, you know, one of those first prize types things, and I was so excited. I just thought, oh my God, somebody hears me. So basically from that moment on, I decided I would just write it down. If I felt it, if I saw it, if I thought it, if I dreamed it, if I anything, I would write it down and maybe one day I'd be able to, um, shoot, I don't even know, like I thought back then that if I just got recognized a little bit, it would be a dream. Each blade of grass knows me, laughing and giggling, <laughs> the sun and moon cradling, but this time would never last. The new me was passed and cast. Who is the air and does it feel me as I run? Can the flower catch my tears although they weigh a ton? Pain shoots through my body and slams me to the ground. Broken pieces all around. Somehow I have aged <laughs> mind and body are battered and used. I long for the days when I was barefoot and carefree. Be cautious, young flame. For you are more than you know. As you grow and elements arise, you will forever be distorted. You will encounter wind, slow and whispering, a gentle song as you feel the urge to dance. Be weary of your light. Wind is very moody and can leave you before you can draw a breath, leaving embers formed. Without notice, take hold of your innocent glow. Every unsteady touch of breeze will imprint and... Now you are ash. Again, though, you'll be charged. You won't even notice as you sway in the misguided light. In the misguided notion of the airy kiss upon your already burning beauty. Cautious. Alert. Vigilant, heedful, careful, guarded, weary, watchful, leery. 
be cautious. Young flame as you grow and elements change. You must remember your power. Showers of embers, blasts of flames, wildfire. Embers remain deep and long after the flame has moved on, seep through cracks in foundation and float a gust of winds, fire and ash. Embers remain hotter than flame. Protection means less air. Be cautious, young flame. For you are more than you know. I can't pull myself together I feel broken and unfixable I don't even know what happened to me In life that was so bad I know you've had it off worse than me but I hate myself so much I can't see straight It really hurts when I can't believe in love I don't understand why For once I can't be happy I just don't get it I can't pull myself together. I feel broken and unfixable. I don't even know what happened to me in my life that was so bad. I know you have had it off way worse than me, but I hate myself so much I can't see straight. It really hurts when I can't believe in love. I don't understand why for once I can't be happy. I just don't get it. I never get to see him, and when I talk to him, it's short. I don't know if I can hold on, and then I hear his voice. Do you know how it feels? Don't say yes, because you never will. I think I wrote this one when I was probably in uh, maybe ninth or 10th grade. Um, and I'm going to read through it with you at the same time that I'm uh, reading through it for the first time since I probably wrote it. Um, but here goes. It doesn't make sense who you try so hard to be. It's like you're changing just so you won't look the same to me. It's almost funny how one day you're amazing and then the next day you make it seem like you're just faking. I can't understand why you want to push me away. All I ever wanted was to be in your thoughts, you know, in a good way. You act like someone I never knew when the night turns to the next day, and then it's just the two of us. And you say things I've never heard you say. You're nothing short of everything when we are all alone. But when other people are around, but when other people are around, that person is gone. Why can't you just be real? 
the person who has given me all the feelings I wanted to feel. You changed for reasons I wouldn't know. Just give me some kind of hint and I'll just go. I seem to have tried everything I could. Everything I could think of to get you off my mind. It doesn't make sense who you try so hard to be. It's like you're changing just so you won't look the same to me. Thank you for listening. For once, you'd spit the truth instead of spitting in my face. Can't you wake up and realize that the only thing wrong here is you ain't in your place? You try so hard to get that attention when all along you had to do was mention my name. <laughs> I would have done anything for you. Would have tried for you. Been there for you. But speak it like you mean it, cause when it comes back on you, you'll need it. All right, here goes another one. Um, I know it says on the paper, quotes by Makia. <laughs> so we'll see what I come up with here. Why don't you start with saying your name and how you got a problem? Because obviously you're in denial. If you think I'm gonna wait around on you to get your shit together, rise up girl to the responsibilities of being real. Can't you see it? You're gonna need it. Can't you feel it? You're gonna miss it. I waited long enough for you to make your first step. Now I'm stepping. <laughs> How you like looking at my back? Put your head down. I don't need your pity. Save that for yourself. Cause you're gonna be wishing that you were with me. <laughs> I mean, hey, I was young. I didn't get noticed in the hallways like the other girls. I had a temper. I was short. <laughs> I was, mm, I guess, unremarkable like so many others at my age. But, you know, I didn't see that. I just saw that I just wanted to be loved and nobody loved me like they loved her or her or that girl I didn't know what was in store for me in the future all I knew was I just wanted to be seen I just wanted to be loved I just wanted to be liked shit for that matter I just wanted to be talked to sometimes I guess Under the circumstances of my shackled mind, I am a slave to this unmerciful darkness. Misery and hardship appeared as something I had to find. Demonstrates cruelness in myself I can't establish. Torn between a hidden good and a shadow of evil. Enslaved in my own misery. I am loathsome in a place of horror, but <laughs> am I fearful? Atrocious fascination consumes me. Will my freedom be abolished? Groans of inconceivable testimony, my apprehension rich darkness, a shadow of memory. I can no longer breathe. Darkness. 
under the circumstances of my shackled mind, I am a slave to this unmerciful darkness. Misery and hardship appeared as something I had to find and demonstrates cruelness in myself I can't establish. Torn between a hidden good and a shadow of evil, enslaved in my own misery, I am loathsome in a place of horror. But am I fearful? Atrocious fascination consumes me. Will my freedom be abolished? Groans of inconceivable testimony, my apprehensions enriched. Darkness, a shadow of memory. I can no longer breathe. I count the shreds of wallpaper as it breaks away from its wall, then smothered with dust. From lack of attention, I watch the fan as it circulates, wishing I could slow it down with my mind. I count the shreds of wallpaper as it breaks away from its wall, then smothered with dust from the lack of attention. I watch the fan as it circulates, wishing I could slow it down with my mind. With Reflections are a funny thing, says the mirror to the copy. Keep screaming for help. Someone is bound to break the glass and free your body. That's it. Keep pounding from behind the cage of desperation and surface veins. You gave me your soul that day so long ago. When you chose to choose me over your true glow Don't worry, love A shattered mirror frees only part of you The rest is a coffin for the deeper truth Reflections are a funny thing Says the mirror to the copy She talks of the wallpaper as if it's almost representing herself. In a way, it seems she wants to tear down the burdens and the shackles of the 1800s. The shackles that hold women down. Throughout, she talks about how no one is to see her writing. I looked at this as women weren't thought of writers they weren't supposed to do independent things their husband and brothers not believing she's sick is showing how men's power could influence a woman's perspective she has to stay in that room because it's the one her husband thought was best and she hadn't the strength to fight with him the wallpaper is the wallpaper is dull and ugly, almost a haunting collar, and so was the blanket. The 1800s laid upon the woman, having to be sheltered and protected. It was... It has no real rhythm shape or pattern without women these men wouldn't have such 
power and ability to control the broken down old grungy wallpaper could represent what she wants to break out of in that society. It's a pattern of no pattern, no reason. Shows the place she and other women want to leave behind. It is falling apart on the outside, but she is falling apart on the inside. She is connected to the wallpaper, but doesn't want to be. She wants to be taken seriously. Understood, she states that there are things about the wallpaper that nobody but me or nobody ever will see. I took that as her saying, there are things people will never know about her. She also stated she'd never have the impressionable child of hers to live in such a room for worlds. She doesn't want to raise her child as the society is. She wants better for him or her. Behind her outside pattern, her external appearance, she's something better, something different, and unexposed. I wrote this about the yellow wallpaper. It's a story about a woman who was isolated in a room by her husband and doctors and people who just thought that she was losing her mind back in the 1800s because she wanted to be freer she wanted to have expression and live her life and she was criminalized uh basically made to seem like she um had lost her mind she was crazy so they locked her in this room all day all night and she just basically watched the yellow wallpaper discolored now peel off of the walls and she just imagined a life outside of that room her own life I feel her pain around the way you crept away bags packed and luggage checked baggage to wrecked where are you headed so sleepy in the dark away from yesterday not leaving to a fresh start. You are running, but not fast enough. The trail you left behind will be corrupt. You won't get far enough. You won't even know. The shadows tell your whole life. The shadows won't let you go. The shadows won't let you go. The shadows won't let go. <gasps> Around the way, you crept away. Bags packed and luggage checked. Baggage still racked. Where are you headed? So sleepy in the dark. Away from your yesterday. Not leaving the track. Fresh start. You are running, but not fast enough. The trail you left will be corrupt. You won't get to far love. You won't even know the shadows tell your whole life. The shadows won't let you go. The shadows won't let you go. The shadows won't let you go. Around the way you crept away, bags packed and luggage checked. Baggage still wrapped to where are you headed so sleepy in the dark away from your yesterday not leaving to a fresh start you are running but not fast enough the trail you left will be corrupt you won't get far love you won't even know the shadows tell your whole life the shadows won't let you go the shadows won't let you go the shadows won't let you go the shadows Wave.